<clears throat> Greetings and salutations. My name is Tish and welcome to the Artist Haven, where home plus art equals heart. In tonight's live video, we, me, us, <laughs> are going to do uh, two cups. And we're going to do kind of like we did last night um, with the white and the multicolors and then just kind of a wiggle pour. But I have a longer canvas. I think it's 12 by 24. Um, either 10 by... Well, I think it's 12 by 24 because 10 by 20 is a little bit shorter. So um, I'm going to do one on kind of one end and one kind of on the other end and see what happens when we stretch it together. So that's the idea. So um, I'm mixing paint here and I'm going to try using the flow acrylic from Artist Loft versus the titanium. I want to see, um, this did have a little bit of the titanium white in the bottom of the cup. Um, I just wanted to see if it does something different. So um, I did uh, equal parts, one part paint, one part Floetrol. Um, and I used the Dutch Boy paint as well. I don't know what I did with it. Oh, here it is. I'm um, using this because if I can get a consistent cloud effect and the effects that I want with this, I'll go, I, go in and buy a gallon of this for like 20 bucks. I think it's like 20 or 25. So, and if I'm getting being, if it's consistent, then why not, you know? So, hello, Jay. I didn't get downstairs to get the rest of the wood <laughs> for my stand, for my drying rack, because I couldn't get, I put a, a what they call the ratchet strap on the wood so it wouldn't slide around and I couldn't get it undone in time to go down and get it so I will bring the ratchet strap with me and then carry it up tomorrow when I come home from work because after this live I need to eat some food do a few edits and go to bed by go to bed at like eight o'clock so All right. I think there is, yep, there is a chunk on my stick. The first flow acrylic was the bottom of the bottle, and I think it, because I found it while I was cleaning. <laughs> so I don't, I know it was rather old, but it was tipped upside down, so all the paint was at the right end, you know? So. Yeah, Jason, you will not recognize the studio. It looks completely different in here. And I made space for the the last of the racking and the new drying rack. And I have all the finished furniture <laughs> in the bedroom office area. Well, bedroom, living room, office, storage area now. <laughs> it's okay. It's just me, and I spend most of my time on the computer. When I'm not in the studio, I'm on my computer. Pretty much, I don't think I've turned my TV on in like a month and a half. It's too distracting. Although I might have to um, turn on TV to turn on the Xbox to see what my email is for for my uh, Microsoft account, because I don't remember what it is and I can't seem to get it to cooperate because Travis just started a mixer account and I gotta go check and see what that's all about because I'm curious yeah that turned out a perfect consistency so it's not too thick and it's not too thin I get a mound so and I've got a medium trace, light to medium trace, 
more on the light side. Yeah. I got everything cleaned up except for this table. It's like anything that I found that related related to painting, I just threw it on the table here. Good thing it's a six foot table. Okay, we're gonna set this aside. That's a good consistency. I don't know if you can see that. My stick is standing up. It's standing up all by itself. Look. Ta-da! Langarium leviosa. <laughs> now it should rise out. That'd be cool. <laughs> Hello, Elisa. I'm being goofy, and I just got paint all on the bottom of my scale. Because I didn't move the painting early enough to let all the paint drips dry. It's definitely a studio scale now. Okay. Whew. My neighbor asked me why I was <laughs> why I was bringing in so much wood. I looked at her. I said, "I do live alone, you know." <laughs> okay, so let me itch my eyeball here and not get paint. I still gotta wash the paint off my glasses. I got paint right in the middle, you know, right in the bro bridge of my glasses. So, okay, so we're gonna do two cups. We're going to do the same colors as we did last night, except for I think I'm going to use, because I don't think, where's the other blue gold? Oh, there it is. I think I have just a little bit. We can use a little bit of the phthalo blue. Those, those two blues would go really good together. So, and then, that's cobalt blue. Let's do a little bit of metallic purple instead of the dark purple and then we'll use metallic green we're going to use that gold again too so that'll be three and then these two blues and this magenta and this neon green maybe some pink i think that's oh we gotta put some yellow in there too i like the yellow in there but we can't put the yellow by the purple again put the yellow by the neon green and the blue Okay. Hello, Brock. Glad you could join us. Okay, so my idea is I'm going to do two smaller cups. Okay, and then I got this 12 by 24 canvas. Um, and I'm going to do like a wriggle pour like right here and do one like right here and then put paint between them and then kind of tippy tippy and see what happens. So, so they're smaller cups. Cause I want to see if I can get the wide lines and the narrow lines and we'll see what happens. And then this I um, mixed, I only had like this much at the bottom of the cup of the titanium white mixed with the Dutch boy paint. So I, I mixed it this time with the white flow acrylic just to see what would happen um, with this combination instead of using the titanium. So. Because I need to go to Michael's on Monday. Hopefully I don't have to work on Monday. Because I have a lot of work to do on Monday. Like 18 hours worth of dishes to do on Monday. And I'm not joking. <laughs> it's like cleaning my studio was a great idea. Because I found all my dishes that I haven't been able to find for the last six months. <laughs> like a wriggle, wiggle pour. I keep saying wriggle. I don't know why. Um, kind of like a tree ring pour, but instead of making circles, you just go, you make like little tiny ribbons. So, I, that's what I did last night is I just did the, I just wiggled it back and forth. Um, so, come on. I'm not putting any, I suppose I could measure out a little cup of something and put some astroglide in it, but I think we'd be better off just sticking with this for now so and these all these paints are recently mixed so they're they're on the thicker side yeah so mix that up probably get paint all over the place okay well let's move this 
put that on the laptop so it doesn't get paint in it. Yeah, I just have a little bit of this blue, this dark blue left. And this is the, this is the phalo blue. No, this is the Persian blue or Persian, is it Persian blue? I can't remember. It's not in front of me. Yeah, it kind of is a ripple, ripple, whipple. <laughs> Just don't call it Charmin. This is the Charmin pour. That's what we'll call it. Because <laughs> do you remember Mr. Whipple? Don't squeeze the Charmin. Am I dating myself? I was a little, little kid when that was on. The Maytag man. That poor guy. He felt no love. Okay. Hang on. Uh, there we go. <laughs> it's my corners, my little corner saver, and there's a little skin on that. I'm so excited though. I got everything cleaned and organized and made room to bring up the lumber from my, my poor XB. <laughs> it's had like lumber in it for the last week. It smells like pine. Yeah, that one. <laughs> that blue brook. <laughs> I don't remember what it's called. Okay. So we're going to do... How are we going to do this? Let's do pink here. Oh, there's a big pool of paint right there. Because I didn't move my... I didn't move my uh, painting until this morning. Or this afternoon. Okay, we're going to do this and that and then that meh I don't want all the dark blue to flow off because that's the one I like let's see metallic let's do let's do the magenta and the pink right next to each other and then we'll do, I want the yellow to show up a little bit. The yellow shows up a little bit in the other painting. Okay, so yellow, metallic green, neon green, whatever blue, light, the lighter blue, purple, hot pink, or neon pink, magenta, and then the dark blue in the middle. No, I think I should separate these two. They need to be separated. I don't, we'll just put the purple in the middle. That'll be good. Because then it kind of goes light to dark. And then we'll go light to dark again. Okay. Oh. All the TP. Oh no. Bumps, bums, same thing. <laughs> that would be awful. <laughs> hey, whatever you want to, you know, when I was a little kid, I went to daycare and my daycare lady, you know, instead of calling it like number one and number two, she called it Tinkle and Grunty. So that's what's always been in my head since I was a little kid. That's what that was what you're supposed to call it. So all right, here we go. We're gonna do them the same because I don't want to confuse myself. I'm gonna do a little bit of white. Oh, I was gonna put a little bit of silicone in the cups. Oh well. I was gonna spray the silicone in there. Because I've got the spray silicone stuff. But I forgot. <laughs> must be, it must be a thing. I don't know. Okay. A little bit of yellow. A little bit of yellow. Oh, we got to remember the gold, too. Hmm. 
Oh, you will slip that gold in right between the the pink and the blue. Where'd my gold go? I don't know if you guys have ever used this tape, but this is the Scotch Blue tape. But it's exterior, and it's like plasticky. This stuff is the bomb. I love this stuff. So, I got that at Home Depot. I don't usually buy stuff like that, but it was on clearance, so I don't know if it's still a thing. But I saw it on their regular shelf, so I think it's just because that was too narrow. That's like an, maybe an inch and a half. And I saw the two, like the two inch one <clears throat> in there. So, I don't know. Here's my book. Give me that. Thank you. Okay. I do like this gold. I do, I do. Okay. I gotta put them in order, otherwise I'm gonna screw it up. <laughs> okay, wait a minute. I need more room. I'm trying not to put it in the paint, but I've already kind of dipped it in the paint, but oh well. <clears throat> yes, constipation gets you a whole new concept of that. I've always had issues with tummy. I've always had tummy issues, so... I got it right away. Okay. And I probably won't buy these cups again because these are these are fairly thick, flimsy. And they're but they're not flimsy enough to actually like all right, I'm gonna do those two and then I'm gonna do a little bit of white. Um They're not, they're flimsy, but they're not like flimsy enough to, um, to squish, you know? Wow, this is really thick stuff. Okay. Oops. Get back in the pot. There we go. Nope, I got a little bit of white in there. Oh, well. It'll come out in this one. Okay, wipe off the stick. Put the lid back on. Actually, we're gonna wipe off the edge first. I'm actually kind of proud of myself. I've only had to throw out one bag of garbage since cleaning my studio. Most of it was like old ray, old like like these kind of rags and stuff that got that fell behind the shelf or underneath a table or something. Good golly, Miss Molly. Okay, we're just going to set that right there. I'm not going to put that on the table. Okay, we're going to put this lid back on too. I'm putting lids on because I have been dropping stuff all day today and I'm like not going to tempt fate. Oh, and I forgot. See, I told you I'd screw it up. <laughs> well, let's put this in. And then we'll put the gold in. And then we'll put more white, and then we'll put the pink. Oh, got a little heavy-handed with the green on that one. We'll make it a little bit lighter on this side. Okay. Grunty faces. <laughs> <laughs> I don't bother. I got an idea too. I have a. I found a bunch of stuff that I need to finish up. So. Let's see, white, the smidge. Oh, that's a lot of a smidge, Tish. Okay, hot pink. And I think we'll finish with a little bit of, like, put a little bit of gold between the pink and the dark blue. Because I really like the gold. Okay. 
I always think it when when people say grunty, I think of little babies when they're, you know, just little and they can't talk yet and they're just laying in their little chair and you can tell they're pooping. It's like, geez, dude. <laughs> it looks like it hurts. I think babies are funny. Or when, when they fart and they startle themselves. <laughs> I probably spend more time laughing at my son <laughs> because he would do stuff like that. Because, yeah, Teddy was, Teddy was a very gassy baby. <laughs> or, or he'd, he'd, he'd toot and and one of the girls would go, Teddy! And then he'd giggle. Because, you know, farting is funny. Okay, we're going to put the gold, and then we'll put the white, and then we'll put the blue. And we'll put another. Maybe we'll put a little bit more. Of the... Hmm. I'm trying to think. Maybe we'll do, yeah, let's do that. Okay. What was I going to do? Oh, yeah, gold. Just a little. Okay. And then the white. Okay. Golly jeepers. Okay, are we at least, at least close to being even? Yeah, we're pretty close. And then I'm going to do the dark blue. And then a little bit of this light. Actually, I should do the dark blue and then a cobalt blue. No, we're going to do this blue. And then in between, we're going to do a little bit of purple, a metallic purple. I'm sure Duncan would be so happy to hear you share that story, Jason. <laughs> okay. Let's put a little magenta in there, too. a little bit. Well, that got to be a little bit more than a little bit. And then phthalo blue. Then we're going to put the dark blue and then a little bit of white. To mix up more of this blue. Okay. 
feet and the red. All right, wipe this guy off. Put the lid on. Hello, Spicy! And Miss Amber, good to see you too. I did find a quarter. Look, I gave myself a tip. Ta-da! <laughs> it's sitting on my table here. I just remembered that I got it. Oh, that was my tip for cleaning all day. All right. Apparently the white doesn't want to go in the container. It wants to run down the side. So I'm going to clean up the edge a little bit. There we go. <clears throat> all right. A little bit of white. Well, that one didn't have a problem. I don't know what its problem is. Okay. So we got those two cups ready. Look, don't they look pretty? They look so pretty. <laughs> and the thing is, is the yellow and the green were the first to go in. So it's going to be, that's what's going to be on top. So we'll see what happens. All right. So I'm going to do a, oh my goodness. Come on, Tish. Get your crap together. Okay. Everything's got lids on it now. Well, it will in a second as soon as I get the gold covered again. Okay. Oh, dude, you know what? I forgot my juice in the other room. All right. <laughs> no, the quarter wasn't stuck to the dishes. The quarter was actually in like a whole bunch of other like odds and ends type things. And I was trying to get rid of all those containers and at least put it all into one container. So I just had one container to go through. And yeah, so. All right. So I was thinking doing one like right here and one like right here. So. Yeah, yeah, one on like one two smaller ones and then just tilt it and see what happens. So we're gonna do one right here. Well there's a little bit of blue in my white. Okay, that works. It's alright. We'll go with it. How did that get blue? Oh, because there's blue on the edge. That's why. Okay. Well let's see what happens if we pour it over here. Okay. All right. Let's do this one first. Speaking of parental job description, I heard my kid say I need to practice my gymnastics. <laughs> <laughs> I need to do. Oh, bother. I remember those days too. All right, here we go.
Ta-da! All right. There's that one. Now, let's do this one. I can't do this left-handed. I have to do it right-handed. My left hand is not what it used to be. All right, so we're going to do... bigger ones on this side, just to see what happens. Whoa. All right. Uh-oh. Don't you remember making a bucket balance beam? Come on, Brooke. Jeez. <laughs> Quit being such a mom. <laughs> yeah, having a meeting with yourself, I, I, I think I can relate to that. All right, we're just going to put a little bit extra white around here so things flow a little better. And then try not to put the white right in the middle of the pour. Okay, do a little bit on the corner. Oh, there's someone screaming in the hallway. I'm so grateful I don't have little, little kids. I mean, I'm, I'm looking forward to having grandkids just so I can spoil them rotten. But that's not going to happen for another 10 years or so. Okay, I need my knife. I'm putting on tights too. Did she watch the Olympics or something? Yeah, I'm surprised I survived my childhood climbing trees and being in gymnastics and being a total klutz. I mean, I'm only minorly klutzy now. Okay, I'm 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 pretty still pretty klutzy. Okay, you cup, you need to go over there. a cheerleader in high school. I didn't hit anybody with my pom-pom. Okay. That makes me happy. Paint. Do as you're told. Make 
sure all the corners get covered because we never like to look at this going on right here I'm thinking I'm gonna get some of that Dutch boy paint when I go in Menards tomorrow okay so I might be a little bit late because <laughs> I was supposed to go to Menards today but I didn't get that far because you know cleaning and stuff but before I I'm gonna let this sit for another minute I'm gonna go grab my juice I'll be right back Okay. <laughs> Ouch. All right, let's torch this guy. You know what we're going to do, though? We're going to fill this guy up before we torch, because I know he was running low. Oh no, <laughs> that couldn't have ended well, Jason. I could just see one of those broom handles going into someone's spokes. Oops, I gotta tip it upside down. Come on, be smarter than the bottle. There we go. And I put my butane like way on the other side of the of the shelf. So even if I do drop it, chances are it won't land in the paint. Chances. <laughs> I didn't do that, but we had, we would play tag on our bikes and we would use objects that weren't safe for bike riding. <laughs> Alright, let's get these bobble, bobbles. Let's get these bobbles all popped. Oh boy, you think I was drinking. Is there vodka in my orange juice? No, because I have no alcohol in my house. It's not because I'm a prude, it's just because I haven't had alcohol in my house. I've been saving my money and alcohol is expensive. Well, the alcohol I like to drink anyway. Um, I'm, I'm done. I, I'm, I'm over 40. I don't drink cheap alcohol anymore. <laughs> okay, so this is going to make life interesting. Let's go this way. And then back. Okay, I want to keep this as much as possible. So, and this one has a corner, a, a bar in the middle. That's why I like these. Okay, so let's go down this way. Whoa. Okay. And back. Okay, let it go. All right. Do. Okay, hang on. I'm going to turn this around again. Okay, we're going to kind of tip it like a so. Okay. 
I'm very back. So, very in the back. Okay. This way. Bring it back. Bring it this way. Okay. Bring it back a little bit. Move it down. And I'm going to move it down. Okay, let's see if we can bring some of this back to down. All right, I think we're going to tip this this way. I'm going to tip this this way. Well, a little bit more this way, and then that way. Okay. Then, use my paint up. There. like that better. Okay, now, yeah.
Okay, so next time I'm not going to put white paint between the two puddle pores. I'm going to try to get that white line to kind of do something different. And it doesn't want to. So, short of dumping all of one side off, which I don't want to do. I think if I would have just not put as much paint between the two of them, it would have been fine. That yellow is insanely yellow. <clears throat> All right. There. Okay. Get that out of my way. Leave that. I didn't put a cover on that. Bad tish. Bad. Alright, I'm gonna move this out of my way. I am gonna torch this just because I can. And there's a clump of white paint in there. I don't have a place to put this. Yes, I do. You can go right there. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, there's a clump right there. I had to wipe off my arms here. Hang on. Ugh. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty intense. I've never done acid, but it looks like a really bad acid trip that has been described to me. <laughs> like every color in this planet has shown up in your eyeballs all at one time. All right. Good Lord. <laughs> okay, so when I'm, oh, this is kind of turning out cool. Um, when I, uh, build my studio, I have to have a hand sink in there. Because, <laughs> yeah. I'm just going over it lightly with the torch here. some paint here. That's okay. I'll fix it in a minute. I've seen if I can get some kind of reaction going on here, but I'm gonna take care of that drip that's on the other side because I don't know where he came from, but he needs to go away. Okay, no. He's not going away. I'm going to lose that part that I like. Okay, so we're going to take <clears throat> my wire here and we're going to just kind of 
you can blend in. There. Now he blends in. Okay. All right. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm going to go buy <laughs> that Dutch Boy paint because I really like the effect of this. I like it better with the titanium white, though. I'm thinking. I don't know. We're going to do another one tomorrow night with the same mix because I've got enough, I think, to do it. Oh, yeah, I was going to get that blob. I just put blue in the blob. There's a blob. Yeah, there's a booger right there. There we go. So we'll just kind of tip it and see if we can't. Oh, there's a booger right here, too. That's always nice. Let's see if we can't get... Oh, that got blue. Hang on. There we go. Let's kind of pat it. Okay. We'll start in the left hand corner here, kind of. I'm trying not to hit my shelf. Okay. Is that in focus, y'all? And it turned out pretty cool. We'll see how it dries. I like the ribbons. I'm glad I put that purple in there. That second batch of purple. I like this. That's cool. Now this, this corner is pretty wicked. I had to hydrate. Hello, Mr. Desert Man. That's pretty cool too. And I like the, the ribbons in there. I'm not a big fan of the yellow, though. But it's growing on me. I went, Well, I put the yellow in last, last night, and it just disappeared. And it's like, okay, I'm going to put yellow on top this time. And you know what? For his, man, I just put, like, a just a smidgen in there. And it just, yeah. But you can see the gold, the metallic, the gold, and everything is just laying. It's just really cool how it's all laying together like that. And I'm glad I got the edges to roughen up. I wonder if I just kind of rub my finger against the back of the canvas. I can get it to move again. Nope. It's done moving. It says I quit. <laughs> All right. Just to make sure we're going to wipe all the edges here. And flip. Okay, don't drop it. Oh, that's pretty cool. I didn't see that. See that corner? That turned out kind of cool. I didn't even have to go in there, but I still, that's my favorite part. That's my favorite part. That whole trippy coolness right there. And there's a little bit on this, oops, sorry to go fast. There's a little bit on that corner too, so it kind of balances out, and the yellow kind of balances out. I mean, I don't like things matchy-matchy. I mean, even a flower doesn't match. You know, flowers are all different. So, what do you think, y'all? <laughs> we can...
Lisa. Uh, we can uh, Facebook Messenger has that video chat thing or Skype or something. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know anything about Skype. I haven't used Skype in probably ten years. So, but we can do it that way. I can put you on my phone right here and, and we can do it that way. And you can teach me about resin. <laughs> I think, you know, it. I wasn't so sure about it, but now that all these cells are starting to pop up in that yellow and it's more becoming green than yellow, like all that yellow that was there this is about the only pure yellow there is on the whole thing well besides that little bit but yeah I'm I'm happy I love this one not as much as the one last night so the one tomorrow night because I've got a little under half a cup so I can I can mix up a little bit more and we'll use the titanium that time I mean we'll use the titanium white that white flow I don't I don't like it as much well we'll mix it up you know what I've got a little bit of flow acrylic we'll mix the rest of that up because yeah <laughs> just to make sure you know but this is that, I put that gold in there and it, it it's not taking over, it's blending, which is really weird. Because there's metallic purple, metallic green, and then that gold. But you guys saw how much gold I put in there and I don't see any direct gold. Like, I see it underlying, you know, this pink right here. And I, I see it right here. But I, it's like, it's like a haze over the top of the other colors. It's like a, a metallic blaze. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it dries. Do you guys want a sneak peek of the other one? I can go grab it really quick. I think. I gotta wipe my hands off more. takes out the 3D visual part you get with in person though. Well, it does and it doesn't because if you have something going all awry, then you can add, you can say, hey, I'm having this go awry and you can show me. And I mean, to be honest with you, once I figure out how to mix the resin and get the colors I want and get that kind of thing, it's different than acrylic, but I it, it has a different flow. I mean, it's like the difference between royal icing and buttercream. They are different things, but they do the same thing. I don't know how else to explain it. <laughs> Background in Heavy Metal Magazine. That'd be sweet. I can handle that. Yes! Hashtag tipsy poor challenge for Mr. Desert Man. <laughs> that's why I have to, that's why I got errands to do on Monday. I gotta go get my alcohol. <laughs> All right, hang on. I'm gonna grab that painting. Sure. If I don't fall doing it, hang on. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, don't drop it, Tish. Okay, here's a sneak peek. Let me go up close. Do you see? Do you see? Oh my gosh, it's so freaking cool. I'll bring it down again, but I just wanted to show you that part. Because that part is my favorite part. Like this whole side. And the lines in the middle, it's like they have streaks of gold in them. When you go like this, you can see the gold. It's like veins of gold. That might be the title of this painting. But look, that little cell right there, this one right here, I can't point at it, but it's got like pink and green and blue and all just like melded together. So it's still wet. But I wanted to show you. Sorry. Sneak peek! I'm not supposed to show you till Sunday. Shh. Don't tell the boss. Butter <laughs> Swiss buttercream tastes better, yes. I will give you that. I don't like American buttercream. Look. Look, look, look. Yes, we're doing drunken pours. It's the tipsy pour challenge. Hashtag tipsy pour challenge. <laughs> the tipsy. Well, see, no one, no one would know except for us. We gotta start. We gotta start a our own little movement before YouTube collapses. <laughs> Tipsy. I'm. I liked that one last night, but this one's starting to grow on me because these cell these cells are coming up. Okay, so I'm loving that Dutch boy paint because it's doing it no matter what kind of other paint I'm using. Because tonight I used just this guy, the flow acrylic from White from Artist Loft from Michaels, and um. And then the, where'd it go? Where'd he go? I lost him. There he is. This is the Dutch Boy Forever. This is just a color sample with no color. It's the interior satin acrylic enamel. Ultra white. Maybe tinted before using. But I need to paint my white my walls white anyways, so I might just get a couple of gallons of that and go with it. <laughs> I have to have you know this is the only time I don't have music playing I've had my YouTube okay so if you want to know what kind of music I listen to on my playlists I have a playlist of all my music that I listen to and it's not all of it it's not all inclusive my Spotify um, playlist is much more inclusive but I also have like four of them on Spotify because I have like my metal mix where it's nothing but heavy metal raw type music. I play that when I'm cleaning. And but I today I was playing the um <clears throat> the my YouTube playlist cuz I got premium now. So um you get 4 months free, why not? So um I was playing that and if you ever want to know what kind of music I listen to there you go. It's, I think it's called Creating Music. And it has a description saying this is the music I play in my studio. So, um, I also um, don't have Spotify. So, I have to listen to commercials. And anytime I don't have to listen to commercials, I'm happy. <laughs> Dutch Boy, I get... Um, from Menards. I don't think there's Menards in, in, um, Colorado. Um, try, 
I don't know if Ace Hardware has it either. I don't know. I know Home Depot doesn't have it. Try like Hirschfields or Benjamin Moore or or not Benjamin Moore. Um, no, yeah, Benjamin Moore is a pain. Um, I'll have to see. I'll have to Google it. Google it. It's just Dutch Boy. I know, like Coast to Coast used to have it, but there's no more Coast to Coasts anymore. But it's just, it's just Dutch Boy. Just like, you know, a little Dutch boy. Um, it might be a Midwest thing, too. I don't know. But I will try. You know what I'll do? I will, when I, when I go into Home Depot next week, I will grab a color sample of the bare uh, One Plus Primer Ultra White, you know. We'll, and we'll see if that works with this. So, I mean, compare apples to apples, you know. I only have four playlists on Spotify because one is for podcasts, one is for heavy metal music, and then one is for, one is my liked playlist, like all the music that I've like hearted. And then my other one is like all really upbeat music, you know, like my Technotronic and, and, and Lady Gaga and, you know, like really super high paced type stuff that I play when I'm in my studio. So... Cause I only play metal. I, I play metal when I'm when I'm painting too. But it, my when I, when I paint, listening to metal music, it gets really dark. <laughs> Cause I grab the black and the purple and the dark blue and and the dark reds and and you know it gets really dark. So, <laughs> cause that's what I think of, you know. So. Yeah, you can always make more. <laughs> well, they had to, the Coast to Coast has been down for like a long time. It's like Montgomery Ward. We had a Montgomery Ward. We had a Coast to Coast. We had a Ben Franklin. None of these places exist anymore. <laughs> so I'm like trying to think of where you can get Dutch boy paint. And that's, you know, Jeez, I'm trying to be nice, Alicia. <laughs> <laughs> could probably order it off of Amazon. I gotta like order paint and stuff next week. I'm waiting for my paycheck. Because all that overtime is gonna be on my paycheck, so it's like okay. I went grocery shopping yesterday too, so I won't have to buy groceries for the next month and a half at least. Okay, so we're gonna see if this is gonna tip in here. So how do you like that? It sits right on top. Just like that, and we're gonna leave it like that, and then we're gonna put this over the top of this, and then tomorrow I'll flip this one into that one. Groovy. Okay, now I need my white cover. Where did my white cover go? Where'd it go? Yeah, look at the, this. Is just okay. I'm gonna show you because I my camera's awesome, but just easier to show you do you see that do you see what's happening there what's happening right here I want to just put my elbow in the paint sad okay fix that okay but do you see what's happening right here do you see that and I didn't do anything it's just happening it's just doing its thing and it's nice and the the paint level is nice it's not have it's it's not like saggy anywhere so there we go never heard of coast to coast hardware store must be a midwest thing <laughs> uh oh it's gonna be really dark <laughs> dude I almost almost spilt the gold paint but that press and seal saved my keister 
I'm gonna have paint on the floor, so I'm wiping it up. Cause that was a really drippy pour. Okay, so we know what kind of happens. Um, it kind of looks kind of chaotic. I don't have. I do have some of my little fingerlings on this side, but this got all discombobulated. So I'm okay with that though. There's gonna be some kick-ass skins on this one. I have to let it dry a little bit and then see. Okay, I'm gonna throw that guy away. All right. Your gateway album. It's the only, well, anything after black album, I don't like. Except for whiskey in the jar. <laughs> but that's just because it's a cool song. <laughs> Okay, so I think tomorrow night I've got a whole bunch of these guys. These are lids from Core Water Bottles. I think if you've watched anything on my channel before, I think what I'm going to do is do like three colors in there and then do white and then do a bunch of flip cups on a smaller canvas and just see what happens. I think that's what I'm going to do tomorrow. I have to go to Menards tomorrow after work though, because I have an idea for our, our, our Saturday shenanigans and our Saturday night shenanigans. <laughs> I might actually just take the day off Sunday because <laughs> I got four hours of vacation left. That way I can just leave. Yeah, tool. I love Tool. Tool's new. I can. I I play Tool. Just the album. Tool's new album on Spotify. Just the whole album. Only thing is, is it's kind of mellow. I mean, for Tool, it's kind of mellow. That album came out the day I went to basic training. <laughs> You play, you have a laser for your dog like people have for their cat? What? You need to listen to it, Elisa. <laughs> oh my gosh. Your dog thinks thinks he's a cat. Well, I figured that the black album was was what you were referring to. That would make sense, considering you're that smidge of a little bit older than me. I get it. I, 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 had, I had to listen to the Tool album because my friend Ben passed away um, August 6th, which was a week to the day, if I remember correctly before the new Tool album came out and I had to listen to it for him. So, and the first time I heard it, um, Mikey was playing it at work and I was a sobbing mess. And he's like, do you want me to turn it off? I'm like, no, 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 I'm okay. <laughs> Cause I just, I, I needed to hear it. I needed, I needed to, to do that, so. And we were supposed to go, Mike and I were supposed to go see the, to the Tool concert, but guess what? They're not coming to Minnesota. Closest place is like New York City, if I remember correctly, or Chicago. It's insane. Why aren't they coming to Minnesota? Hello? We like Tool too. It's whose birthday? What? I missed something.
Yeah, maybe it was just the one song that came out on the 13th. Ugh, I would not skip Tool if they came. I would be, like, <laughs> eating ramen for a month just so I could go. <laughs> okay, I gotta find... Oh, dude. It's the... Oh, no. My... Oh, good thing I noticed that. Erp. Hang on. I gotta find a bottle to put this in. When am I paint this? It cracked. And now I got a puddle of gold paint. But I have a bottle. Hang on. I got a bottle. Okay. The good thing I noticed that, hey. Good thing we were talking about tool. <laughs> All right, move that up a little bit so I don't get paint on it. Yeah, it's just slowly leaking off the back side. Dude, dude. I don't care what gender you are, I'm gonna call you dude because I call everybody dude. I don't care what color your skin is, I don't care who you are really. I don't care if you're the president of the United States. I'm going to call you dude. Because I call everybody dude. It's like gender neutral. Okay. Let's get this all scraped out. No, I'm sad. Well, I'm not really sad because I should have probably done this a long time ago, but... I lost some of the paint. Okay, so this is also with that new metallic that we used yesterday. The um, 24 karat gold, but the, um, oh hell, Deco Art Americana Metallics. And this is the bright gold. So, okay. That's going in the garbage bag. There we go. Okay. Oh. I have another garbage bag started because my, my little garbage bag is like overflowing. Okay. So. This gold that we used tonight is this. It was $7.99 at Home Depot or at uh, Hobby Lobby. Let me get the tag off of there so you guys can see. There we go. Still have some of my fingernails. Yeah, the Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics. It's bright metallic paint. And it's a 24 karat gold. And I'm finding that it works. It's bright. It's just like the extreme sheen stuff. And it's cheaper. Because for it's a dollar an ounce. Versus a dollar, well, is it cheaper? Yeah, it's cheaper. Because the other ones, it's two, it'd be a dollar, like a dollar twenty-five an ounce. So, Yeah, I get that. Puppies are, puppies are, I, I, you know, <clears throat> I've only been close to a handful of dogs and they weren't even my own dogs. And that's why I, I'm hesitant to actually get a pet because I, I don't know how I'd handle it. Oh, squeaky toy on his birthday and the puppy's birthday. Got it, got it, got it. <laughs> primal flow paints no i have not if it's something that i can't get locally i probably have not because i i have a thing about ordering on the internet 
I, I do it for th certain things, but <clears throat> for like paints and stuff, I'm a little hesitant because my luck, I have the worst luck. I mean, I'm grateful that I have Jason because normally my luck is I have the worst boyfriend you could possibly have. And I found Jason though, so I think he is, he is my turn and good luck. Okay. I know I had a cover for my white paint. Where did it go? Oh, well, I'll just cut another one. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh. But I'm going to try and go to bed early tonight so I can get up early tomorrow and do some work on the YouTube channel. And I am going to um, set up my lives for the weekend um, in advance. So and I will share the link for the Saturday shenanigans. Um, so that way you guys can share it if you wish to do so. I will put it on Instagram. Well, I can't put it on Instagram because they don't let you link things, which is stupid. I can figure it out. I'll figure it out. Okay, there we go. Stick that to the wall. Stick that to the wall. I don't know what I'm going to do when I put the fabric up. Because I'm going to put fabric up on that wall once I put the other shelf up. So it doesn't... I don't get the reverb. Okay. Okay. There we go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, the circus. <laughs> It's moving out of town. <laughs> oh, I don't have that. I have like 125 followers, I think, maybe on Instagram. I can just put it in there. They just have to type it all out again. I could do a bit.ly link or something. I don't know. I'll figure it out. All you have to do to, to find me, though from on any on twitter on youtube and on i think on instagram is do hashtag the artist haven so because that's on all of my videos now um yeah i have a link in my ig bio but it doesn't show up So I don't know what I have to, I have to attend to that. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. <laughs> oh my gosh, don't you know? Is my Minnesota showing? <laughs> oh boy, I need to go to bed. I need to eat food and go to bed. Yeah, it's 8 o'clock. Oh my gosh, it's almost my bedtime and I haven't even had supper yet. Oh jeez. I had a late lunch though, so I'm not really that hungry. All right, I got you on Facebook now, and I think I figured out how to do stories, but not really. I'll figure it out, maybe. I might have to have you help me. <laughs> All right, if you liked this video, please smash that like button. And if you like this video and would like to share it, I invite you to do so. I would be eternally grateful. Has I our channel has hit a hundred has hit a thousand hours of watch time, but we only have 118 subscribers. So I need butts in the seats. We need butts in the seats, and that's when and I, you know once we hit 1,200, I'm happy. I'll be done. 
I'll be done asking for subscribers. I'll be done asking for anything because that's when you hit that 1000 mark, that's when you get to start doing all the cool stuff, you know, like, you know, super chats, which is meh, but like memberships and I can go live on my phone without needing a separate app and, you know, and, and we get a community tab where everybody can, can, can um, comment and post pictures and you know that's the reason why i want a thousand is is honestly for that community tab because that way we can all share on there so but i will see you tomorrow hopefully if everything goes right um remember your three things to be grateful for and i am grateful for you peace love and happiness